Uh, we'll keep them on us for now. Let's go and find this lady. Just ignore everything, let's go. And then we'll go... Actually, let's go and get the ice first. Then we'll get the lady. Oh my god. Fucking health stuff. Come on, you bellends, let's go. Ignore the bitch. Up, 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 and up. Let's go, motherfuckers. Are they all here? Okay, they are all still following. There's a sign there, I'm not sure what it says. I don't even know if this is the guy we're supposed to be killing. But we can't do it until we're at least got better weapons and armor, because fucking hell, we're getting our asses handed to us. Oh my god, fucking health stuff, yes. We will take all of this. Thank you. There's a cave there. Um. Okay, now whoever was soaring is banging frantically out of the outside. Not entirely sure what the fuck they're doing, but whatever. Let us journey forth and collect the ice of which we must have. Duh. And now there's ice flames. Brilliant. Fuck's sake. You guys deal with these fucking idiots. Um, I'm gonna... Collect as much ice as I can. Please don't pass out because I'm not carrying you home. Right, collect as much of this ice as we can. Fuck out my. Stop it, you asshole. Fuck off. Jesus Christ. Right, let's bounce. Get some more here quickly. And I can't see us needing more than a hundred and ten. Come on, let's go. I'm actually starving. How much does that do? Not a lot. Better than nothing. Da 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 da. I wish they'd pick up stuff that they got off of dead things. There's an igloo. Oh, it is quite literally just an igloo. Oh god, my god, you guys are such assholes. Just, I'm trying to fill this fucking igloo back up and you're just getting in the way. Okay, there's an igloo. I don't know what that thing is over there, but there's a sign in front of it, so we should probably go and check it out. But first, let's collect some health stuff, because honestly, we've pretty much done this entire first part of the chapter with next to no medicine. And I would like to have some. Stop attacking us, you fucking assholes. You come through the fucking red teleport. Nothing but aggression. Like everything that wants to eat me. For the fucks? Just kill them all. Murder them, now. I'm done with these fucking assholes. Murder every single cunting last one of the bastards. There's one. Ow. Come on, you fuck nut. There's another. And there's the last one. 
Get up, you dozy prick. Get up here, now. Come on. Fuck off, Yogi Bear. Powie Yowie, motherfucker. Yippee ki -yay. Oh, some emeralds there. Oh, it's Mithril, not Emerald. I do apologise. Oh, my hammer fell apart. Do we have a spare? No. Do I fuck? Can we mine it with my sword? Yeah, pretty much. Just not very well. Thank you. Let's go and get the lady, shall we? Although, you guys are going to have to do all the work when the monster's attacked because my sword's about to fucking break. Stay away, it's too dangerous. Oh, brilliant. Wow, I'm almost dead already. Fucking ghosts. Fucking hate ghosts in this game. They're annoying as shit. Holy fuck. Um. Screw that. Why was my guy randomly hitting that way? Stop it, you fucking idiot. Just smack the shit out of him. Oh. There's some. God. I was surprised my sword's lasted, to be honest. Go on, fuck him up. Should have built some new tools before I came back through. No, he's running away. Get him. Yeah, motherfucker. Thank you, thank you. You saved me from the monsters. My friend Bird and I set off several days ago to try and trace the source of the pillar of light we saw in the distance. But we became separated in the snowstorm and then the blizzard cleared. He was gone. You know Bird? He sent you in search of his bride-to-be. I'm afraid there must be some mistake. Baird and I are just old friends. But still, I'm most grateful for your assistance. I'm Cecil. I can't wait to see this hideout of yours. Come on, bitch. Let's go. And that guy just got fucking friend-zoned. Oh, great. Now one of them's asleep. Now everyone's asleep. Guys, wake me up. Uh, it's Kaye, motherfucker. Guys, this way. Oh my god, they're annoying as shit. My people are just retarded, I'm telling you. Right now, they're all fucking retarded. Are any of them actually following? Oh, they are, for once in their lifetimes. Go away, you fucking asshole. Let's go. We're going home. You can friend zone the guy to his face, and I can not get killed by all of these monsters. Seems fair. This place is amazing, Harry. I've never seen a town like this before. There are so many people here, and they're all so wonderfully burly. <laughs> Pardon? You wonder why those horrible robots were trying to get to me? Oh no, it wasn't me they wanted, but my most precious possession, this pretty little key. Which door does it unlock? Uh, I haven't the faintest idea, I'm afraid. You see, it isn't really mine. I found it lying in the snow. It looks so shiny and never so pretty, so I had just had to take it with me. It's been my most precious possession ever since. 
Tee hee. By that greedy look in your eyes, it seems you like it too. Sorry, Harry, but you can't have it. It's mine. Well, sorry, lady, but this is my t uh, town. You can't have it. Get out. Seems fair. Nice one, Harry. That ice is exactly what I'm after. It's just what we need to build Galileo's flame fighting invention and stop these rotters stealing its secret. Oh, his secret. What's that? You want to know what this secret is? Alright, I'll tell you. He was working on a way to combine fire and ice to you know, a way to harness the power of the elements and turn it against the monsters. I was just helping him out, so I don't know how it works exactly. But it looks like the monsters want to get their grubby hands on the power so they can use it for against us. Never mind all that now. No, first things first, we got to build ourselves some flame killing machines. What do you reckon, Harry? Do you think you can come up with some con combination of ice and iron what will snuff them prancing blighters out eh, I think I can give it a go oh she gave me some lava fucking top crack shot a blistering bullet imbued with polar power a sea shot a burning bullet imbued with magmatic might rock on right get in there got some mithril. I um, have a feeling we're going to need a little bit more of that. Let's make ourselves a new hammer. And a new... S I don't know. Do we need another sword? No, let's make two hammers. And now we'll go and make some of those... Oh, no, 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 no. Let's make some fucking health potions and stuff. Healing cream, top on, medicinal herbs, five is good enough for me, and chimera wings, we need some more. Uh, I don't think we need any of that either. Uh, no. I want to move that to there. Right, let me go in here, click on that, we'll make... I didn't even check to see what that cost. Um, one iron and two lava for 20. Sure, why not? We'll make 60 of each. I didn't even check to see if it's... Is it the same, just with ice? Yeah. So it's one ice... Uh, one iron, two ice, or one iron, two lava, which makes the bullet stuff. Which I guarantee she's going to ask us to make some anyway, so we might as well have made it. Put that there. And put that there. And let's talk to this guy. Thank you, Harry. Thank you. You saved Cecil, my dearly beloved bride-to-be. We were travelling through Gowland home when a terrible snowstorm stirred up. I took her hand in mine so that we might not be separated. Just imagine my surprise when the sandstorm abated and I found myself hand in paw with a powie yowie. Oh, my dear heart, bright, my bride to be, how glad I'm to see you again. I beg your pardon, Cecil told you that we were friends and nothing more. Ha ha ha, my dear Harry, do you think. Uh, do you know nothing of the fairer sex? Mere feminine modesty, I assure you, ha ha ha. Ahem, anyway, I thank you from the bottom of my heart for rescuing my bride-to-be. She doesn't want to go out with you. You're like 90. Look at your hair. Uh, living among these blunt and boorish muscle men will no doubt be an affront to her ladylike sensibilities. But be assured that I shall defend her from those rogues to my very last breath. Well, I'd prefer it if you and that bitch would get out of my town, because you're both annoying as shit. Um... Bye bye, there. Can you come down here and talk to me, please? Thank you. Alright, Harry. Have you built any of them ice missile thingies you dreamt up yet? We can use them to take down those dancing flames, which will, uh, which will bring us another step closer to beating the Magmalis. Let me tell you something, Gary. According to Galileo's records, when you freeze a dancing flame, it leaves behind a flame orb. And those orbs are exactly what we need to build an even more powerful weapon. 
So, that's what you gotta do. Build a load of them crack shots and fire them at the dancing flames. You know where to find them, right? They're laying around the front of the castle the monsters locked me up in. Go over there and kick up a ruckus and bring me back five old flame orbs. Why don't you? Go on then. Sure, whatever. Let's go. Uh, blue one. Right, motherfuckers. Yippee ki -yay. I don't even know what that film's from. What did it? Is it from a film or is it from a TV show? I can't fucking remember. I don't even know where I heard it. Um, I want my hammer, please. You might be needing that at some point. Let's get me some of them flaming orbs. Or I could just starve. That works too. I'm surprised that hand didn't attack me. <coughs> right, well, we've got food in us. Let's go and kill that fucking flame over there. What's this sign say? Oh, we read this. It was the monster. It was telling us about the castle and the mine. Oi, fuck that. Eat that. Oh, okay, it's quite easy. One shot kills it. Come on then, bitch. Oh shit, I missed. Oh, I missed again. Oh, fuck off, Gollum. Oi. Oh. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm not doing very good with this, am I? I'm trying not to get hit by the Gollum. And they are very hard to fucking hit. Will you fuck off? Do you want a nice boat? Go on then. Yeah, bitch. Fuck you. Get back here. You don't get to fucking run away from me. I'll be trying to stamp on my head, you asshole. I've already used 11 fucking things and we've only got three fire orbs. Uh, well, there's the last one. Give me your orb. Let's go home. Fuck you, Magmalis. Eat ice. Oh, I missed. Have it, you cunt. Fucking asshole. Right. I think we need to go and get some uh, of the ice ones as well. She's probably going to ask for ice orbs. So we're probably going to have to go through the other portal and make some of them. Uh, collect some of them even. We need more food. Have they made me any more food? That's a baganda. Looks like she's begging to her. Don't kill me, please! That's right, Barbella. You fucking tell that bitch. Um... Ladies and gentlemen, will the real Knights of the Round Table please stand up? Oh my god, it's enormous. What? Fucking Jesus. Fine, do you know what? Screw this. There's a table in the centre of town. Anyone that's got a problem with it, I will murder you. Um, oh, there she is. Oh, blimey, you beat the dancing flames and collected the da uh, flame orbs. Them crack shots you invented must be pretty flipping powerful. Alright, let's see if we can't combine the power of that, the shots with the power of the orbs. And build a weapon what will make the Magmalis think twice. The Magmalis is a monster made totally out of lava. All I've ever seen of him above the surface is this massive burning hand. We just... Got to figure out a way to combine the power of the fire and ice and we'll be able to build something that'll make the Magmalis hold that hand up. Thanks for getting older of these orbs, Harry. I'll give them a proper going over and see if I can't come up with a plan. Oh, cheers. 
Right, Harry, can I have a word? I've been looking over Galileo's notes, trying to work out how he's, we're going to build a weapon powerful enough to beat the Magmalis. But the lads, God, de Goddess bless them, keep breaking my concentration. They're like, Oi, Barbella, will you spot for me? Uh, will you spot me? Or, Oi, Barbella, do my pecs look wonky? I was never that good at thinking to begin with, but I can't just can't focus with all uh, with them lot going on all the time. Uh, that's why I need a room of my own, a place where I can concentrate on my research without having the boys in my ear all the time. Sorry to ask you another favour, but if I don't figure out something soon, we'll never get that ultimate weapon built. Yeah, I drew a sketch on. Uh, or the kind of thing I'm look, uh, talking about. If you could set me a place up for me, I'd be the happiest woman in the world. Of course, I'll be needing something to write my results down in. What do you say, Harry? Can you help me out? Go on then. Now can I make a book? There we go. Now I know how to make a book. Right, well... Where should we stick your fucking base? Uh, what do we need? What is in it? Um, why the fuck do you have a button on your wall? Why do you need a button? Um, sure, whatever. Let's build it over here. Yeah, I know the room destroyed a fucking... I was the one that took the wall down. Fucking thing. Right. And... Um, okay, we're gonna need to take away these and these. For now. And Oh, it looks like we're gonna have to take down these ones as well, just because the blueprint's a fucking asshole. Uh. Oh brilliant. Perfect timing. Thanks guys. Like perfect you like you know when to turn up, like when the wall's not here. Yeah, thanks. It's annoying that you can't place down a blueprint when there's a wall behind it. Like, you can't place a blueprint down when there's a wall in the way. It's just retarded. I'm already hating the design of this place. Uh, getting upgraded in a bit. Oh, fuck off! I just built that, you asshole! Cunt. Oh. Which one of these was... Okay, that one needs to be a button. And we need... Four bookshelves. That can fuck off. They can go in there. Um... That goes... There. Oh no, she wants a fancy door. Yes, she wants a fucking fancy door. What a bitch. Fine. Here you go. Fancy fucking door. Now, how do I make these bookshelves? Okay, there's a book. Oh, that's what we need the fucking flowers for. Well, we now have five bookcases. If she complains now, I'm going to break her jaw. Um, didn't we have a spare book? Oh, we do. Okay, give me one of them. That goes on there. And she wants a barrel. Have we got barrels? We have... Yes. 
one barrel, one fancy door, and a... We need some springs. No, and a button. Awesome. One button. And oh yeah, you want a chest. We got a chest. Yeah, we do. You're not coming in this way, you dumb fucks. What is it missing now? Oh, a lantern. Can we make them in here? Yeah, we can. Awesome. Thank fuck for that. Now, I'm going to stand outside, uh, fresh that, grab that. I'm going to do that, that. Wow, it didn't reach these. And whack. And can it reach? No, it fucking can't. My phone is having a mental breakdown right now. I can hear it over the other side of my room. Uh, we need some more straw floors. Have we got any more straw flooring? Oh, we do. Right, let's go make some straw flooring cadding sort of thing. Whatever it's called. Um, there. That'll do. Give her a nice floor. Awesome. There we go. Now she's got no way to complain. I'm going to be back in a minute. I'm just going to quickly save it. <laughs>